Thoughts on Kinloch Burvey there, John? Well, the pilot says it's the uh, third busiest fishing harbour in Scotland by catch landed. There was nothing in there when we came in, but there's lots and lots of uh, fish warehouses and trucks and things, so probably it gets really busy when the big trawl oh shit, I might just have a collision here. I thought the rule was past port to port, yeah, because yeah. it's um, different here in Scotland. Anyway, yeah, it, the fishing ports seem empty, but I guess it's the big trawlers that come in. Um, it's such a quirky place, there's just nothing there apart from the fishing harbour and the, the big trucks and the big uh, sort of landing quay. So, we've just got to decide where we're going next now. Um, quick trip across to Stornoway in the Hebrides does sound exciting. It'd be a shame to come all this way and then, and then not see the Hebrides, but there is a sort of um, a bit of a southwesterly blowing up tomorrow, so we might get stuck there, I don't know. So what did you decide? Well, we decided we're going to head across to Stornoway. It's about 45 miles. We're heading a little bit into the southwesterly chop, it's not too bad. Um, neither of us has ever been to the Hebrides, and it just seems so close, it's a one-off opportunity, so we thought we'd do it. Goodbye, son! I think we're going to get wet, Fion! I think we're going to get very wet! Nice. Okay, Fionn, tell me, where are we? Uh, yeah, Stornoway, I had to think for a minute. Yeah, Isle of Lewis, uh, Hebrides, Outer Hebrides. Um, thought we'd pop over, took us a little longer than we thought, and just got hammered by wind and rain on the way. It's pretty grim, actually. Only for a few showers, but at some point, it was just like needles going in your eye. I couldn't see anything. I had sunglasses on, cap down, windscreen wipers on, hiding, but I thought we were just gonna have to stop and wait it out, but yeah, we got it, now the sun's shining. Look at it. The Shark Bay, Shark Bay, Stornoway Harbour, over. Go ahead, Stornoway Harbour. Is that way, is it? Yeah, there's a uh, space on the pontoons, uh, the most southerly berth on the outboard side of the Hammerhead. The outboard side of the Hammerhead, over. On every voyage you're going to get the bad weather days and we're stuck today on Stornoway and the Hebrides. It's blowing a force six out there and it's just not the sort of weather you want to be going out to sea. So we're taking the opportunity to have a look around the island instead. It's the sort of thing you've got to do if you're trapped in harbour. Get out, have a look around the island and check it out. And it's the first opportunity we've actually had to do some tourism, some real tourism. So we're just going to drive the whole island and see what we can find. It's an awesome island, so different, so big. I didn't realise this particular island was so big. Um, we've been up to the north so far, very different to where we are now, spectacular mountains, big sea locks. This sea lock comes about 10 miles inland, I think, and goes to the sea. <laughs> but it's deep enough, there are sort of some sizeable boats in here. I've seen yachts come in and uh, fishing boats sheltering from the weather. And behind us we've got some spectacular mountains. So um, it's a great day. Just rented a car and we're seeing the island. Definitely worth doing. I'm not disappointed that we got stuck here. 